Kristen Milhone read all the baby books about what to do and what not to do before Jack was born. It's like as you become a parent, you read so much and you hear so much and your doctors tell you and it's drilled into your head. But there's one thing she couldn't find in any book. The possible dangers of this, the Phillips Advent Soothe Pacifier. Kristen says they give out these pacifiers at the hospital. They're supposed to be safer and more sanitary. So I picked them up and I was playing with them and then all of a sudden like, I saw like this like bump on the side of his head and so I like got up real fast to turn the light on and he had this like blister. It almost looked like a chemical burn. Kristen says Jack fell asleep on top of the pacifier and it suctioned to his face, leaving this burn when he woke up the next day. We went to the emergency room and they didn't even know what it was. They were like, they thought it was ringworm at first. Kristen just has to put antibiotic ointment on the burn and go back to the doctors for follow-up appointments. If it doesn't heal, they have to take Jack to the burn clinic or even a plastic surgeon. Since his skin is so thin, the burn could leave a pretty bad scar. It's just terrifying, like, you don't do all this stuff, and the one thing you may do is, like, suction cup a pacifier to your child's head. But it's, you're supposed to be allowed to have that yeah. with your thing, so it's just kind of scary.